Brief Loss by Lindsay Duncanson Black and white, three-channel video work depicting three domestic scenes. In the left channel, a white man in his fifties sits sullenly in his pyjamas. His chin rests on his fist as he sits in his armchair, staring into the distance in front of him. He takes a generous swig from a mug. To his left, the door to the room is wide open. Projected within the door frame, pond skaters flit around as light shimmers on the water's surface. A clock sits above the door frame. He fidgets with his feet intermittently, folds and unfolds his arms, and occasionally takes a drink from his mug. He seems bored. In the central channel, a white woman in her forties with a bob cut crouches on the ground between a bookshelf and a table laden with houseplants. She's also wearing pajamas. She leafs through a book distractedly, occasionally looking away from it as she does. Then she puts it back on the shelf. She shuffles around in mild discomfort, resting her arms around her navel. She allows her gaze to wander around the room. She takes deep, purposeful breaths. In and out. She stops to arrange some flowers and looks contemplatively into the middle distance. Behind her, the door is ajar. Projected into the space are clouds reflected in gently rippling water. She continues breathing deeply. Looks around. Then she picks up another book and starts again. In the right channel, a white male teenager with long hair is engrossed in a drawing with pen and ink. He works on it with fastidious precision. A computer screen flickers with static to his right. Beamed into the space, behind where he is sitting, are the blooming, flowing patterns of foam on peaty water. It resembles strands of DNA, or perhaps a celestial phenomenon. Occasionally, he dips his quill into an ink pot to replenish it and promptly returns to the drawing. Fade to black. 
videographers Lindsay Duncanson, Marek Gabriš and Lucas Gabriš. Sound, Marek Gabriš. Editor, Lindsay Duncanson. <laughs>